President Trump says he's not happy with the immigration deal reached by a bipartisan group of lawmakers. They have until Friday to come up with a plan the president will support before parts of the federal government run out of money and shut down again. Natalie Brand reports. CBS News has learned President Trump is likely to sign a congressional border security deal, but he didn't have great things to say about it. Am I happy at first glance? I just got to see it. The answer is no. Congressional sources say the bipartisan deal includes nearly $1.4 billion for physical barriers, including 55 miles of border fencing, but no wall. The president had been asking for $5.7 billion. Please, Mr. President. No one got everything they wanted in this bill, but sign it and don't cause a shutdown. The president also says he's proud of the wall now being constructed on a big section of the southern border near the Rio Grande. Last night at a rally in El Paso, Texas, his campaign handed out finish the wall signs. Just so you know, we're building the wall anyway. When asked by reporters, the president says he's still considering whether to declare a national emergency to go around Congress to get his wall funding. But many members of the president's own party say they'll oppose a national emergency declaration and they do not want to see another government shutdown. It's not everything the president hoped to get, but I think it's a good step in the right direction. Uh, I hope he'll decide to sign it. First, Congress will need to pass the new border security deal by the Friday night deadline. Natalie Brand, CBS News, the White House.